What's up, guys? Give everybody a second, get in here. What's been going on? Let's see who's up in here. Hey, Joe Shine. Hey, Stevie Steve. Let's see if I can move this over a little bit. What's up, Drill Bits? Sammy Nixon, Donald, Kevin. What do you use more now? Cody or APKs? Uh, honestly, I still use Cody more, but I have them both loaded. I use Cody more because I got my real debris. What's up, Donald? So who is the N NVIDIA Shield Backups King for us and whenever it crashes? What you mean, Donald? Hey, Jeezel. What's up, Party Lee, D-Rupt, Carly Carly Way, but Boat Lock, Luck, Diedrich, Pat, Patricia, Scott, Hangouts acting up again. Hmm. That might be why they terminated. Man. Okay. Hey, Phantom. Unless I got a notification. Hey, Rich, Jacob. Um, I'm, I'm not sure what's up with the notifications. Hey, Steve, hoping you can help me, for, please. My NVIDIA updated to Cody 18. How do I go back to 17 version? You could uninstall Cody 18, Huey, and then um, go to my file link. I need to put my file link in um, the description of this video. You can go to my file link and download Cody 17 or go to Cody.tv for slash downloads. Matter of fact, I'm gonna make a video. I'm gonna have to make a video. But uh once you install Cody 17 again, turn off automatic updates. Or you can leave it at Cody 18 if you have enough space and just install a fork. A fork could never update. You don't even gotta turn off up automatic updates off. That's actually what I do. I got Cody 18 installed, and then I have a fork. What's up, Melvin, Brian, Cray, Arthur, Kathleen, Troy, Secret Agent, Big Mike. Hey, Caesar G, Andrea, Brian, good evening, you noise, know, Vern. Hey, Steve, first time asking a question. Best app, the ones you use. Uh, I got that file link. The file link are actually the ones I, that I'm using. Go to the uh, file link. Actually, I'm, let me, what a video. See, where is it at? Where is it at? Where's the file link? I'm going to put this in the description. My file link. I'm going to start putting it in the description for the uh, 
the videos. There's the file link. Let me see. Somebody else with the notification. Okay. Did you hear? Did you hear? Hello, Steve. Hey, Blackbird. Did you hear about 13 Clowns? It's like the only thing that really works. No, it's not. No, it's not. You got 13 Clowns I've been using. I've been using that one uh, in Digs, two scrubs. I still use Legendary. All the scrapers pretty much work the same as uh, as uh, 13 Clowns. But uh, yeah, they, they are uh, stopping development. So they closed down shop. I also heard somebody took over their repo. Not sure who it was. Somebody took over their repo. So they say it's not them. And uh, if they took over their repo, they can update. They could up have an update to where they want to install something that they want to install. So Urban Geeks. Um, from Urban Geeks. I mean... If you're selling, I mean, you could do both. You could do both. You kind of go hand to hand. What's up, Rudolph? Cal? Phantom Eric, Mr. <coughs> Mr. J052576. Steve, is there a way for me to update my video shield for? Some reason it's not Chrome casting. That's weird. Um, what what version are you on in your shield? Are you on Ariel? Hey, Michael. Wee wee <laughs> wee wee. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. What's good, Steve? What's the best alternative TV box to Nvidia Shield TV? It depends. It depends. Like I told you guys, um, right now the devices are kind of like almost downgrading. Instead of um, actually, the new Fire Stick had just recently came out. The Fire Stick 4K, it's a whole lot better than that Fire Stick second generation. A whole lot better. It's way better than the second generation version. The Fire Stick 4K. Um, Mi Box S if you want Android TV OS. If you want something like the NVIDIA Shield TV, I kind of like the Android TV OS a little bit, bit better. Well, I'm not going to say I kind of like. I like it a whole lot more than Amazon OS. The reason being, the main reason, it has adaptive storage. So I can expand my memory. I know most of those Amazon devices are coming with 8, eight gigabyte storage, 8 gigabyte ROMs. So you got about 5 gigabytes left. It's not too much storage to do anything unless you have that cube. That cube has 16 gigabyte ROM, but that's still not too much. So that's why I like the Android TV OS more. Um, more. But um, I will say that Fire Stick 4K is nice. It might be even better and faster than the Mi Box S, but the Mi Box S kind of push it above for me mainly because of adaptive storage. But if you just needed a secondary device and you wasn't worried about adding space to your device, I would choose the Fire Stick 4K over the Mi Box, Mi Box S. So I like them. I like the more quality uh, devices like them, but not quality devices, but quality names because they actually, if you buy them, if you buy a Nvidia Shield TV, if you buy a, uh, Amazon Fire Stick. If you buy a Mi Box S and something happens to it, you have a warranty. You can return it. Now, I like the budget boxes too. Don't get me wrong. I like the S912. 
uh, S95X is okay too. You, you switch the firmware, it's real nice. Um, but the problem with the budget companies, if something happens to it, you kind of like, you just got to buy another one. If you can't switch the firmware to fix it, you pretty much, you're out of there. Because they'll say, some of them say like a year warranty, but it's like so much trouble getting it, you know, from a budget company. And if you buy it from Amazon, you pretty much only got a month. Like Amazon's good because if something happened when you get it, you could just send it back and get your money back. But after that month, it's like, what do you do then? <clears throat> What's up, Jason? Scott, Tony Techno, Sincere. Hey, Steve. Hey, Paul. Paul up late in the UK. Clifford in, from New Jersey. Carlos Tolarius. Caesar G, best APK to get local channels without the antenna. Some of these channels have their own apps. Um, the best thing for locals, honestly, will always be uh, HD antenna to me because it's just your locals. That'll probably always be the best thing for a big number of locals all in one spot. It'll always be a HD antenna. But um, then you could go to some of these apps. Some of the apps, um, some of the channels have their own apps that you can use and load. Yes, Steve, TV add-ons has done it again with 13 Clowns. Ooh, they're persistent. So it was TV add-ons. I know uh, Tim uh, from Ferry, well, and Dominus Bills, he had hit me up and told me about it. I was like, you might want to tell people that um, it was hijacked. So I don't know. That's the thing with um, some of the things with development. People try things instead of just giving people a choice. What's up, Tim? I heard 13 clowns. Yep. The 4K stick is really good and it's cheap. Yeah. Especially when it was that two for 60. Amazon is some geniuses. Why does Cody 17.6 with Diggs build kick me out from Chuck? I need more information. What, what, what build is it? And what device are you using? Hey, Vern, Josh. Let's see. Hey, Steve, can I still use Durex in my Cody? Yeah, you can use it, but just realize they have stopped development for what? About two, three months now? Maybe a little bit less, but they it's been a while since they stopped development. So a build's nothing but customization. Just because a builder's not updating that build anymore doesn't mean you can't use it. You can still use the build. It's just that you won't get any more updates to it. So you have to pretty much do your own research and install your own add-ons as they start coming out. Which you really don't mean, need too many anyway. To hack the system. I don't think they can really hack it. I don't think they're going to do anything bad. They m probably mainly want to get the add-ons on there by taking over 32 or 13 clowns because it's, it's something like an advertisement. Hey, any new bills for Cody 18? You haven't put out anything yet? Uh, Because I'm not really too into Cody 18 yet. I love Cody 18, but as far as my regular use what i use on a daily i'm staying with cody 17.6 but i will i will th throw you guys some cody 18 builds but it's just it's a little bit slower to me it's a little bit slower to me than cody 17.6 and uh i was having people that was having problems with it that's why i stayed at cody uh 17.
Steve dropped me a thing. Uh, you got Tyler at Trooper. Trooper, he chooses the mods, Phantom, after a while. So, holler at Trooper. Where is Trooper? How you feel about Magic Dragon? It's pretty much my go-to. I love Magic Dragon. Magic Dragon is an excellent add-on. And it's actually his own add-on. Because, you know, he actually he puts in work. Because he actually goes and hunts down these links and put it into his add-on. So, I always love Magic Dragon. Magic Dragon. Um, Maverick is another one that's like it, too. You know, similar to UK uh, Turks. I want to build Cody. Which one is the best version to build from my phone and the video show? I will do um 17.6. 17.6 to stuff get more stable with 18. Unless you really have to use 18. Or you can install both. If you have enough room, install both and um just jump between both. You know, see how 18 is acting. And once it's, you know, moving a little bit more smooth than 17.6, hop on it. The Facebook group and video shield TV users saying you are the person to follow because you are legit, bro. Keep up the good work. Thanks, Steve Garcia. Yeah, I dropped the link for them, too. They're a pretty good group. I dropped them their link for them when they first started because it was just a bunch of people, uh, users of the device helping each other. I like groups like that. Everybody's stealing everybody's stuff nowadays. Yeah, it goes like that. It's kind of hard because this stuff is open source, you know? So when you think of it as open source, um, it's open source. That meaning, hey, anything I see, I can kind of use and kind of do my own. But it, it, even though it's open source and you can do that, it's still a respect level thing. You want to be respectful to people so people don't hold bad grudges against you or you don't come off the wrong way. So one thing I learned, as long as I treat people re with respect, you know, and talk to people the right way, anybody will pretty much say, hey, go ahead, Steve. Go ahead. You can take it. You can do this. You can do that just by talking to them. A lot of times, just by asking somebody something, it's just a better way. So, and it, it's not really creative if you take something and just do it the same way. The vault is working great. Yeah, the vault is working great. I just did a, a video for that too. You guys want to check it out. Best build for Cody 18. I like I like uh the digs uh builds for 18, but they are slower than the 17.6 builds. Also, um what's the guy name? I forgot his name. You you uh you Cody has some 18 builds. There's quite a few people with 18 builds. Hey, Steve, going to get a shield, do I need a keyboard? I recommend a keyboard. Well, I recommend a keyboard, a mini keyboard for every device. Every device. I mean, that's usually my first buy. When I have people ask me about it, I always tell them the first thing they need to get is a keyboard because it's going to make navigation a whole lot easier than these little remotes and stuff like that. So I personally use the Not Logitech K400 Plus. I know a lot of people don't like this. It's dusty. She old, but um, it works for me because I got big hands. But a lot of people like different things. I think, what is this one? I forgot the name of this one, but this is like a dongle mouse, iPad port. I like this. If I had to use a mini keyboard, I think I'd use this. The most popular one I've seen is that we RII. So I, I would definitely get a mini keyboard because unless you're just going to use all the apps from the Play Store, and I doubt people do that. Well, some people do. <clears throat> I 
just logged on. What's the deal with 13 clowns? Well, they shut down yesterday, and the rumor, well, not a rumor, it's actually a fact. Somebody hijacked their repo, and um, now since they hijacked their repo, they can install what they want to. Today is my birthday. Can you please wish me, please? I can't pronounce your name, but I definitely wish you happy birthday, Barrett Mystery. B H A R A T Mystery. M I S T R Y. Happy birthday to you. I hope you're having a great day. I use UK TV now for local channels. Try it out. For locals, boats. Hey, Mar Margaret, Joe, Minna. I also found my um, I found my ROMs. I found my hard drive with my ROMs, so I'm probably gonna add that to the file link too. Twenty four seven, Carlos. I'm not sure, Carlos. I'm not sure. I I think they do, but no, they might have took it out. I'm not sure, Carlos. Honestly, I only use it for my live channels. I don't depend for no service for a VOD. I got VOD services. Hey, Andre. Hey, Steve. Have you got any beta updates lately for the Shield lately? No, I haven't got none in a while. New update for the Shield. I'll download it right now. Really? Let me plug my baby up. Let's plug her up. Let's get her fired up, y'all. See how we help each other? That's a great thing, man. That's a great thing. We help each other. A lot of you guys help me. So that's the great thing. Hey, Pat. Hi, Steve. How's it? How's it that one person with 25 megabytes has zero buffering? But someone else with one gigabyte buffers often for DP sixty six. It depends, DB sixty six, because buffering is not always related to speed. It could be related to that device. Also, if it's wireless, if you use a Wi-Fi, maybe that person with the twenty five megabytes download speed has great equipment, and that person with the one gigabyte. <coughs> Equipment's not so good. So it could be that. Then it could be the source. And if the source is messed up, really nothing can fix it except for that source. Let me scroll all the way down because I'm getting I'm getting far behind. I apologize. And then I'm just going to go back up. Sub hippie girl. See, if I added 32 gigabytes to my Fire TV 4K using a fork, using using a uh, micro USB cable, it works. Did you add it? Did it add to ex uh, external storage, or are you using it as internal, Rudolph? That's good. I didn't know they did that. I know the last Fire TV, I never tested on a Fire Stick 4K, though. That's huge. So Rudolph says she added a 32 gig to her Fire TV 4K by using a micro USB cable, and it works. Now, did it, did it adapt to internal storage, or is it still external? That's what I want to know. Because it'll go to external. But the big thing is internal memory, because your internal memory is where your apps go. Hey, Sharon. Urban TV, where did it go from Greg? I'm not positive, Greg. Oh, oh, yes, I am. Yes, I am. I think um uh I think the urban one shut down. I think it shut down. It was getting um harassed and stuff and shut down. Steve, did you ever uh, get your 4K remote to pair with the Shield from Brian? You know what? That day that I was trying to pair my stuff, you guys was right. It was the batteries. The batteries were dead. These batteries, the Amazon batteries don't last too long. 
because I know I got some batteries I had forever. So I haven't tried, but I was trying on my devices and um, it wasn't pairing either. So we could try that later too. We'll try that later too. To pair it. But it was the batteries that were the fault. I see a large number of us are reluctant to let go of Cody 17.6 and go to 18. Was it like this with the older versions, Clifford? Always, always. Like I said, when I was on 16 and 17 first release, we stayed on 16 for a while. When I was on, um, well, 15, we stayed on uh, 15 for a while before 16. <clears throat> I don't think I hopped on Cody 17 until it was like Cody 17.3. And then I started using it for a daily. But before then, I was still on 16. It's probably going to be the same way for 18 as far as me using it as a daily. So it's always like that. So second set. Steve, check out Hyperspin ROMs. I haven't used the Hyperspin yet, Phantom. I always just go around with the, um, just install the apps and then use the ROMs. What's up, CopCam? CopCam has a beautiful feed, guys. I was up like way late. And the CopCam was in there working. I was like, wow. It's using OBS. We're going to have to play around with it in a minute. Why can't you install Cody on PS4? Because Sony will never let nothing go down like that. Um, Sony is pretty much, a, um, you know, they, they're, they're leading the way right now. So uh, even though Cody is legal and uh, it's just open source media center, I don't see Sony ever allowing uh, Cody on the PS4. But you have a web browser, uh, stuff you can look up on your web browser, but the, I, don't, I don't see them ever doing Cody. You know, Xbox is a little bit more flexible. Xbox is the type of company, you know, you got Sony, you have, I mean, you got your PlayStation 4, you got your Xbox. And at first they was battling to see who was going to be number one to Xbox pretty much figured it out. Hey, Sony's going to be number one, but what we can do to still get our money is we'll be a solid number two and we can make ourselves more flexible and open to different avenues and that's what microsoft has did like you know they're they're doing they're allowing games like to go with the pc they're they you could do a little bit more as far as uh they um the the cody i even think they did something with the um what was that i like to say retro arc or something like that i'm not positive i gotta check it out but they're a little bit more flexible they're not as flex. Sony's not as flexible because they really don't have to be. Should or can I use a mini tablet, on, mini keyboard on my tablet that what I use, Cody? You can use it if you want to, Sabrina. Uh, I know some skins are kind of rough on uh, touch screens. They're not compatible with the touch screen. So if you run into a situation like that, yeah, you could just pair your mini keyboard to it. JJ Core Cutters. Hey, Jay Sullivan. Troop. What up? Fine. Out. We got, uh, well, I'm going to send it to you. Remind me. Because we're going to start um, for the sponsors. They will have a private chat. All right. So I think we got like three. So okay. I know Jay Sullivan. They'll come up with that name. You see him with the little symbol by their name? I got him. <laughs> so they'll have a private chat. And that'll pretty much be their reward for being a sponsor.
Steve, I have Cody 18 running smooth with UKD Cody one community build install. Yeah, you Cody one got some. I mean, it's cool. Cody 18 is not bad. It's just 17.6 smoother. No. Cody 19 by Steve release date, summer 2019. Look for it. Joe <laughs> Sean, crazy. Some of the stuff in Magic Dragon are not working. Yeah, Joe, because he pretty much uses his own links. So it could be like that. Say if the link go down and he has the link on something, it might not work until he updated. For live sports, Sabrina, I'll just get a uh, actual service for it, honestly. Hi, Steve. What are you broadcasting for? From thank you for your service from John. I'm broadcasting from uh Google Hangouts until they take it from us. They're supposed to take it from us soon, but I always broadcast on Google Hangouts and I have a Logitech. C920 uh, webcam. So since Google, Google Hangouts can't do no more than 720p on the feed, a C920 is perfect. Thanks for the $5 super chat, secret agent. Hey, Steve, trying antennas direct clear stream for Max TV antenna, 70 plus mile, but can't get Recepts receive any channels, any antenna re recommendations from Aggie? They're pretty much the same, Aggie. Some of them, the only difference is some of them, like you said, have different mile radiuses as far as what they can reach. But um, they're pretty much the same. The ones that I tried, I really haven't noticed a difference in the HD antennas. I could be wrong, but to me, they're pretty much the same. But that's the problem with the H. That's the main problem with the HD antenna. Depending on where you live, your reception, you might not, it's a possibility, you might not be able to get channels with the HD antenna. So I probably send it back, um, look up the HD antennas uh, uh, on Amazon and see, you know, try one of those. And if you're still not getting channels, it might just be your area where you're at. Okay, we caught up. Thanks for the five dollars super chat, Rudolph. Hey, Sabrina. I was I was holding off. I am here in Colorado Strings. Hey, G. Smitty. Hey, Steve, I love that vault build. Yeah, that vault build is built, but be careful because, like I said, it has uh, nine builds, and it's kind of tricky because when you first install it, it says it's only extracting to about 500 megabytes. I mean, 500, um, forgot. <laughs> I think, yeah, it's about 500. And, um, but once you st start installing them scans, the build gets heavier because the skin actually adds, you know, um, data as well. So if you install all nine skins, you're looking at about two gigabytes. Look at about two gigabytes. So if you have something with um, with no uh, adaptive storage, if you have something with low storage, Fire Stick, you might want to just install like one skin at a time, at most two. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Paul from Spring Check, Texas, checking in. Hey, Paul. Hangouts acting crazy, troop. It used to let you know how many people are here and everything, but we don't know. But everybody here. Cause it's not telling me. Uh, everybody here, smack the like button, man. Smack the, once you slap the like button, it lets people smack get notified. Thumbs up. Let's go. Thumbs up. Um, 
Three hundred, we give a box away. Come on. So how do I become a sponsor? I have no idea, Joe. <laughs> Jay, That's Dr. crazy. Jay. I don't. It's somewhere. Let me look it up. From YouTube. Once you go to my channel, got DJ Themes in the house. Once you go to my channel, Joe. How do I do that? It's not gonna let me see. It's not gonna let me see it. But once you go to my channel, it'll give you an option to subscribe. If you're already subscribed, it'll ask you, do you want to sponsor uh, this channel as well? Once you're on my channel, it should. Let me see if I can see it. I'm not signed in nowhere else. I need a fake page. Need a Kevin Durant page. So I can, Kevin Durant had his fake little Twitter where he could check out. That's what I need. I need some fake pages so I could just log in and look at things like um, it's not me. That's good to have. So I could see the things y'all would see. But I can't see it on my screens. But when you subscribe to me, it'll say something like, um, Sponsor, would you like to sponsor me as well? I can't show you guys. I will show you guys, but I can't even, it won't even let me show it. We got Thanks for the $2 super check, Eggy. Keep up the teacher. I'm learning a lot. No Good problem, time. Eggy. 214 watching. Smack that thumbs up. Come on. What's up, Juggernaut? What does it mean to be a sponsor? Like you have to pay. No, a sponsor, you pay like some, like you agree, like you could choose amount. Like say if you wanted to um, add like two or five out for, I think it's either $2 the minimum or $5 It's something. But you could say like, okay, I want to give this person $2 a month or something like that. So I really didn't know what it was until they started asking me to make badges and stuff for it. And then I had people signing up for it. So, you know, they were just doing it just to do it because I didn't even ask them to at first. So we're going to make them a um, chat, you know, kind of reward them a little bit. Yeah, I have it set up because I have some. I don't know how they did it, though. I have some sponsors. I can't really honestly... Let's see if I can see it. It should be a join us. Let's ask Jay Sullivan. How did you do that sponsor thing? Because I can't see it. Because it's my channel. I can't see it. Let me see. Let me try to go to somebody else's channel. I can't see it here, or even the people. I'm... I see it on my phone, though. Supreme Builds has it. Let's see if I can see it through his. No, Supreme Builds has it for sure. So I'm subscribed to him. I'll check it. Okay. Here we go. It should be a join. Once you go to the channel, it should say a join and member. Get exclusive perks when you purchase a membership to this channel. It should say join. So. I mean, make something for them. Can you see it when you go to my channel, True? I can't see it. You can't see it either? 
Nope. Are you see the see their little uh, icons on their uh, which one call it? They switched it. That's why. Enabled. Enable. To turn on channel memberships on your YouTube channel, blah, blah, blah. Get a join your channel, blah, blah, blah. See, they changed it. It used to not be like this. Before, it used to be, it used to be like, my member could choose what they if they wanted to do like two dollars or something. Now they made it that you guys have to pay five a month. That's crazy. They change this stuff all the time. Chat with channel members via community posts and deliver all your perks to show your appreciation. So once we'll have a private. Yeah, they changed it. That's why they took it off. You know why they probably took it off? This is a good one. So we could talk about this because this related. Enter your custom perks and submit them for review. What will your channel members for their payment? What will you provide channel members for their payment and how will you keep the interest over time may you deliver everything you offer you don't want to disappoint your biggest fans to come blah blah blah, blah. exclusive live streams huh We recommend using members only community posts. Okay, we'll do this later. Cause I'm gonna have to set it up and stuff. So I'll make it later so you guys can do it. Yeah, I'll do it later. Cause they changed something. They I gotta read through all that stuff. So I'll figure it out. So it was enabled. They just, I apologize, guys. Yeah, they changed it. It's changed because now <clears throat> it's something like $5.99, $4.99 a month and all this other stuff. And I got to put the description. So I got to read how to actually do it now. Why does YouTube have you streaming at 120 head to change mine for highest resolution available from Gail? Because whenever you're, especially if you're on um, Wi-Fi or you're on your, not Wi-Fi, if you're on your mobile data or something like that, what it'll do, what YouTube do is kind of like auto protect you. So say you're out and about and you're on your phone and you're using your phone data. When you go to that YouTube video, it pretty much will have like the lowest kind of, it might have 140, it might have 240, and it kind of adjusted due to how much data and also it'll adjust it to what they think um, you'll get the best experience uh, dealing at with that speed. So a lot of times you have to adjust it. But if you're on your PC or something like that, usually like my, my PC, when I go to watch a YouTube video, I never got to adjust it. But when I'm out and about with my phone, I always got to adjust the, um, the YouTube uh, the YouTube video. I always have to put it on 720 or 1080p. But yeah, remember that if you guys are already, if you guys see my videos, my videos will always be at 1080p, uh, 60 frames per second, unless I'm live streaming. If I'm live streaming, it'll be, they're only, 
because of uh, Hangouts. So they'll only be at 720p. I am on a fire stick from Ricardo. What what build though, Ricardo? What build are you on? Because it could be what we just talked about. Your fire stick might be getting too packed. You have not too much space on it. And that's that could be kicking you out. Steve, can you please do a video tomorrow on what picture settings you use for your TV? Just curious what you think is best for MacTube X. I've been wanting to do that, MacTube X, but the honest truth is it's it's hard doing it. Like say, um, it depends. It differs per TV. Like say, say if I had like a a a, a, um, a, a Sony a Sony TV, and I did these certain type of picture settings and stuff, it might not be the same picture setting on your Vizio. So for the only the only way I could really really do it, and kind of really help people is I had to have a lot of TVs. I had to have my hands on a lot of TVs, but that was something I really did want to do because no people have problems with that. You know, I used to have problems with that, but the only way to do it right, I'll have to have, you know, I just couldn't do one TV because if somebody had different version or somebody had, had bought it from a different company, it probably wouldn't work for them. So that's the only way to do that type of stuff right. But it's a guy, what is his name? I can't remember his name, and he's real good. He's real. Good. He doesn't do too much of it yet anymore, though. But he used to do the picture stuff. He's real good, but it's not too hard. But I, I, I do know what you're talking about. Work, because we all have too much, di too many different TVs. So I have, I have to have a bunch of them. I wish I did could though. That'd be fun. Why does my NVIDIA Shield buffer at 1080p or 720, but my, my Fire Gen 2? If you have it on Wi-Fi, that could be the reason. It could be the reason. Maybe you're getting a better speed on your Fire uh, Generation 2 for where it's at, you know. And then if this is like you're watching two different things, it could be the source as well. So if the source is buffering, it doesn't matter. But more than likely, it could be the Wi-Fi. Icon. I'm gonna switch it up, guys. I'm gonna fix it. Thanks for the super chat, V Man. Hey Troop. Hey Troop. What up? What up? What up? See if uh, who do we have? Juggernaut just here. Jug. That's it. Yeah. You can send him a thing. I'm hey, trying to Triple M on here. Triple M said he was coming on here soon again. Where you at? Any new console coming out next year from Caesar? I think the PlayStation 5 is supposed to be uh, uh, coming out. I'm not sure the date. They keep on changing it because it was supposed to be like in the 2019. Then they said 2020. But the PS5 is the new that's the newest one. Then once you guys know, once they release, <coughs> all the bombs start dropping. Once your competition release a device, you guys start releasing device. So at the PS5 comes out, it won't be too long till Xbox drops a device. I'm very disappointed. Thanks for the five dollars super chat, Arthur Reed. I'm very disappointed. That uh, I'm disappointed at Sony. I'm disappointed at uh, uh, Microsoft, Xbox. I'm disappointed at Steam. How do you let Nintendo get exclusive rights to uh, Ultimate Alliance 3? So they got exclusive rights to them. I'm like, man. Mm -mm -mm. So I'm going to have to find a way to uh, take my baby 
Nintendo Switch. <laughs> I'm going to have to figure out a way how to take a Switch. I, I love Marvel Ultimate Alliance. I can't believe they got an exclusive contract. I don't want to play on a little handheld. I want to play it on my uh, Steam. I would love if they got it. Yeah, they keep on changing the date, V man. So I'm not positive when PS5 coming out, but that's probably the next big big thing to come out. She'll talk. If you get a Nighthawk, will it stop buffering? From Q Hunt, um, not necessarily. You still your network is your network. So what you pay for in your download speed, that's what you're getting. Now, if you have, let's say you pay for uh, 50 megabytes download speed, but you maybe once you leave, once you're not hardwired or something in another room, you're only getting 10 or 15 megabytes of what you're paying for. But you know you're getting that full speed. Now, getting some better equipment will correct it so you get closer to that speed or that speed, and there that could help it if it's that way. But if you already have a low speed, say if you got super low speed, just because you get a Nighthawk and you still have that super low speed, it's not going to make a difference. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna put some 18 builds, uh, out, Ryan. I'm gonna put some out. I've just been sticking with 17.6, but I'll put some out. Which is the best modem and router to buy? I can't honestly answer that question. What I have personally, I have a Nighthawk X6, X6, and I have, um, what's my modem? My modem is the um, where my modem go? SB six one. You got a sixty one ninety. Yeah, so I used to have a little box back here. I don't know what happened to it. This stuff back here is going to get back in order, guys. The summer is almost here, and I get my personal assistant back. I'm going to put her to work. Put my daughter to work so she can get this stuff back in order back here. What's up, Caesar? Crazy, you have a nice setup in your background. Thanks, Caesar. Going to get a 65-inch TV this weekend for March Madness. Any suggestions from DB66? I kind of need your budget or what you kind of spent. What you want to spend? Kind of need your budget. Stevens page, go to top on the topic bar. I won't see that no more. Oh, we got Aldrin here. He just uh, joined Diggs team. You send him a link. Yo, Aldrin hit me up. Oh, I think I got him. Hold on. He might be at now. Nah, he ain't at work. 
Let me see if I got them in hangouts. See, this is different. I, I gotta figure. I'm gonna figure it out after. After um, after the live show, I'm gonna feel like you can figure this because I want to drop a video tomorrow too. But I'm gonna figure this thing out. Cause now I got you guys answering me. I hate when they um, just change stuff. I hate when they change stuff. So now I got to read it. I want to read it before. Yeah, because it's not supported no more. Oh, yeah. Rest, rest in peace to King Kong Bundy. So he died at 61. It's a lot of these wrestlers dying real young. So he died. I remember King Kong Bundy. Uh, Luke Perry also died too. What was Luke Perry? Luke Perry was 902 and 10, right? He was the first like TV sitcom, sitcom crush, the pretty boy guy. What's Esmar? How you doing? Hey, Minna. What's up, Part Music? 90210. Yeah, he was like the first pretty boy. He was the pretty boy before all the rest of the pretty boys, Luke Perry. That's who everybody used to talk about. I used to be like, why do everybody like this TV series? Well, it was very popular. Steve, how you play Watch Dogs 2 on Steam? I haven't played Watch Dogs yet. It looks great, though. Matter of fact, I think I bought the first one. I'm going to have to check. What's your opinion of Review uh, Dork? Uh, I watch him. I watch some videos he do. I watch everybody, man. I watch everybody. Um... My opinion is he's doing, he, for what I've seen, he do pretty good. He's pretty good. A lot of these guys are pretty good, man. So. How do you feel about LeBron missing the playoffs? Um, how do I feel about it? Does it upset me? <laughs> it doesn't upset me. Um, I don't. Th I didn't think he would miss the playoffs. It's, su it's surprising that he is going to, but uh, I mean, it is what it is. I think the NBA needs to probably start getting ready for post LeBron anyway. And let's face it, LeBron's not the best player in the NBA anymore. You know, Father Time catches. Father Time is undefeated. So sooner or later, there's going to be other, and these other young gunners are just, you know, it's their time now. He's coming. What's the best way to back up your NVIDIA shield from Donald March? It depends what you mean by backup, Donald, because if you want an exact copy of your NVIDIA Shield TV, it's only a couple apps that can do that. I know um, if you want an exact copy of it, you'll have to be rooted. And it use, I'm not sure if it works, but it was an app that's called uh, Titanium Backup. And you could pretty much copy everything, the data and everything of the apps you have on your Android devices. They had to be rooted, but it, it worked for every rooted phone back in the day, all the rooted phones. But for the Android TV boxes, it really had problems with it. 
Only I only ran into about one or two Android TV boxes that it worked for. I'm not sure if it's working for NVIDIA Shield TV. So other than that, get you a file link. I need to make a video on how you guys can do a file link or do the file link or save your APKs and stuff that you have on a separate, your external device. So if something happened, you can just load it back. What's up, Alger? What's happening? How you doing? Good, man. Good, good. How you been? Pretty good. You jumped to 18 yet? I think yeah, yes. you did update a bill for 18. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got um Owls Flicks for 18 with the gaming section built into it. With the gaming section? Mm -hmm. What do you like better so far? Do you like, are you, is that your daily using 18 or are you still on 17.6? I still use 17. I mean, I, just, <laughs> See, I, I keep, everybody go stay with 17. <laughs> I, just keep, I mean, especially if you're a builder, like you, you know why, you know what I'm saying? Because yeah. it's, th there's still some limitations. Like for me personally, my favorite thing about 17 is the super favorites. Yeah. You know, I, I, I completely customize the super favorites and, and I make all these specialized folders for easy access. But when it comes over to 18, see, normally before you'd be able to transfer stuff, you, you're like, okay, I'm going to take my whole super favorite folder from 16 to 17. You know, yeah. I've been able to do that each time, but on 18, it, it, it's like half the stuff is there. And, you know, and I spend hours and hours updating it and it's like, damn, that's one of my, so that's one of the bad things I think about it, but it's just, um, there's a few other things, you know, not all developers have jumped to it yet. Yeah, so, all the skins not compatible yet either, are they? Who? All the skins not compatible with it yet e either, are they? Oh no, and that's the thing too. Like, I, you know, I'll update a build for seventeen, and someone's like, "Hey, is that available for 18 yet?" I'm like, "Wait a minute, that's a let, let me catch my breath, guys. I just updated something. <laughs> <laughs> let me." But you know, that's the thing about it. Yeah, not everything is 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 there. Like some of the skins I made, you know, with my previous team. It's just it's just not available yet. You know, it's all about the the developer. So yeah, people understand that that you know it, it's people try we try to get the stuff out to y'all, but it, the developers, you know, got to make these things. That's what keeps it ticking. Not not the builders. You know, if we don't got good add-ons and good skins, there's nothing that that we can put out for you. At least you know reliable. <laughs> Which one of Diggs builds the game in addition? He, the um the Zenon. The Zenon's the game in addition. Alger just said he made his build. Was but Al Flix got the game edition? Yeah, Al Flix and uh Xena. Oh, Xenax got it? You don't got Zenon no more? Let's see. Cody No Limit build works great for 18.1. I ain't checked that out yet, Totally Tecmo. Are you going to put the gaming around? I'm going to try to put them on uh, the foul link, Aggie. I'm going to put everything I own. I own all the stuff that I'm putting in my foul link. I, I, I personally own. Their game. Oh, you got <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to start one. Yeah. I just started one. Yeah, I started looking into that today. I'm like, oh man, that's going. That's I'd gonna rather be just show them how to do it on their own. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because it's it's a process. So I was like, you almost have to really have a computer if you really want to do it right. Like, you know, I, I did it, it on the phone. Oh, you did it on your phone? Oh yeah. yeah. I just laid down one night and started doing it. But yeah, you write it's a little. It'll be smoother on a computer. It'll be smooth, but uh, it's okay. It's not too hard. Yeah, it's cool. But I'd rather just show them because, I mean, I think a foul link is kind of personal to me, honestly, because yeah, it's yeah. like the stuff that you really want. Right. It's not everything that every single app out there in the world, like, nah. that's what I think too. Like, if you're going to create a file link store, it needs to be apps that you use and that you, you know. You use. Yeah. Like, say, if you had, like, if you needed to do a box real quick or something for... Mm -hmm. Or or something like that. The stuff I use, boom, let me do it. I seen a lot of stuff. It was like the Google Play Store. I was like, nah, that's y'all defeating the purpose that way. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so th that's that's why I would rather just show them how to do it. I mean, I'm gonna keep mine updated for the stuff I'm using. But I, I, you hear people like, why you don't got this? Why you don't got that? 
I was like, because I really don't use that. Right. So that's why I didn't have that on there. But I'll, I'll try to add it, you know, stuff that they like to, to it. But I just don't want a, a lot of unnecessary stuff in it because I'm going to be using it myself. Mm-hmm. You know, so I, I'd rather just show them too so they could have their own little personal stuff. So what personal build do you use on your device right now? Are you just using add-ons? I just use, honestly, I use, uh, I use the stuff that I usually just make a video on. <laughs> just keep it I'm, on there. <laughs> honestly, that's the honest thing. I'll end up doing it on my living room where I watch TV, <coughs> TV at. I got um, the vaults on there right now because I could change the scans. And then I yeah. got the APKs. But when it comes to using stuff, it's really no favorite one because, you know, all I really want to do is watch the movie anyway. Mm-hmm. But, I, but I keep some stuff on the thing in case, you know, I get some company. You know how that is. You get some company and you want to show them some stuff they probably haven't seen before. So I leave some stuff like that out. But I'll, I'll use any build that I just do a video on. Yeah, that's how I kind of get stuck. Like if I'm reviewing one of Diggs, I'll just I'll even if <laughs> yeah, it's there I'll already. It the box. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, I'll, I'll use this through it. Steve, have you used Cyberflix? Yeah, I use Cyberflix too. Yeah, they've came a long way since the beginning. Like, I they it wasn't my favorite at the beginning. Like, and the and the developer kind of got on me about it because I was, you know, just tell them how I what I thought of it, but. Yeah. Ever since, well, I tell you what, that's that's one of the best, you know, terrarium uh, replacements you can find right now. Yeah, yeah. And Steve, I like can you do a TV. video of re- removing stuff related to thirteen clowns. I think you just all you, all you gotta do. I can do a video, but all you gotta do is re- remove the repository from it. Some people was talking about the uh, the scrape. Uh, what is it? The scraper too. What that Cyvita scrapers? Yeah. Oh, that's a separate repository. No, I think it's it's just by itself. I don't even think it's in the. I think it just gets installed when you install it. But yeah. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, kind of like in the guts of things. Some what some did, they, did like somebody there. install? Did they install the uh, other stuff once they hijacked the repo? Oh, I bet they did. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't checked yet, so I don't know if they did. I'm gonna check later. Yeah, I ain't even open up more the like, More than likely, you probably put one of those two laps on there. Somebody called it like a crypto, what they, what, a crypto mining or something. I guess they can do that. Oh, they did all the, that? that. That they were talking about from a previous time, but they said, yeah, they probably did that again because that's. That, I guess that's what they did. I don't. I, See, I don't yeah, know I did that before. Yeah, TV add-ons. They put like one of the. I think that's what somebody said. Is like they put one of those. Uh, I never. <laughs> I never seen TV add-ons do nothing like that. Yeah, I can. St- you know, they do some stuff, but I never seen them do nothing like that. Yeah, like when you remember installed- they used to report it to us. Right. I think somebody said like you know because when you installed the repo, the uh, what is it the the main repo that they use? It's like a some type of tool. The and install, well, the indigo. Yeah, the indigo. Once you install that tool, then it installed all these other things, and you, you wasn't able to uninstall them. And supposedly, some of those options were like the the, the bad stuff. You but know? you know, a lot of times too, it'd be a lot of scare bait. Yeah, you know the real thing about it too, because they a lot of them beefing with each other. <laughs> so I still don't get that. I really don't. It's it's <laughs> like <laughs> they beefing with each other, but I can. Like I could say, okay, yeah, that's wrong what he did, but I can't overdo it because I ain't never seen no crypto stuff. Because yeah. he actually used to, uh, he used to warn people about the crypto stuff. Now he he he's persistent, and he can be <laughs> a bug at times. But I don't think he never did thing. I think he just mainly wanted to get his stuff in there because it leads you to the website, and you know, you get paid by the ads. Yeah. Well, that's what I thought it, it meant is that it, it just led you to something else that yeah you get revenue from yeah but I mean he could but yeah. anybody could right anybody could put the crypto <laughs> as long as Even they some of the other free add-ons yeah it just yeah. Be- <laughs> yeah I tell you one that was a good idea was the um 
man, I want to say it was like before Genesis. It was a uh, ice stream. I think. I think you were doing a video on that too before. Ice Remember stream. That? Yeah, ice streams turned down because what they were doing was while the links were loading up, a little um, ad was playing, and I yeah. thought that was cool. I, I, I was like, well, it's not. It's not hurting us at all because it's not like we're waiting for the ad to end before we can watch our content. It's simply playing in the background while the links are loading. And I think if more developers did that, man, I mean, they're going to pay for their own servers and things. I mean, that's, that's just my personal thing, though. Yeah, that's not bad. I don't like the websites. Yeah, yeah, no. I don't disagree with them because, you know, but I just really don't like going to pair. <laughs> yeah. But what's up, Bo Nose? You, you want to Trooper? Yep, you I got get him. Bo, Bo I got him. If you wanted to get one, I got him. Urban Kings. Urban Kings, people keep on asking about your stuff. Where is that? I think he said he's updating a, uh, his add-on now. He just started talking about oh, it. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah he's going to re-update the... Uh, he's working on it. Mm -hmm. Soon to come. This stuff, man, this YouTube stuff, they keep on changing everything. What do you think about Article 13? I never read Article 13, Caesar. You know anything about Article 13, Alter? I ain't heard of that. What is it? That <laughs> <laughs> Let us know what it's about, Caesar. <laughs> <laughs> what is it about? Let me know. Wait, wait a minute. Let me see. Did you say Alex Flix is ready for 18? Yeah, it's ready for 18, Fernando. You yes, got uh, gaming. I do want to mention, too, on the gaming. Um, it, not everything's available. And, and people, they get a little upset, like, if they try to play, like, a Nintendo 64 game or something. Mm -hmm. It's just the way that 18 is right now, not every emulator is, is available yet. So it's like day by day, Cody – you know, maybe they'll add a little something in there for it, but it's not, you're not going to be able to play every game. Now, if you linked up retro arch, you're going to be able to play everything. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And and all the ROMs are still going to come from archive, archive.org. So you don't got to worry about that. Um, and it, it, so if you want to take full advantage of being able to play, you know, ROMs inside of Cody still, you need to have something external, which is the RetroArch app. You're going to link that. Up. I'm going to. I'll do a video later on. I'm sure Steve, you, you probably do a video on that as well, man. But it's it's a. Uh, I think it's the best way to retro game. Um, for, yeah, for RetroArch is the most flexible. Yeah, especially for new people. Well, like subscribe to AM's, well, no, Aldrin, Aldrin Mayfield. That's his YouTube channel. Too. Yeah. I'm gonna post your link. Post your link because I know once I post your link and they subscribe or watch a video, I get paid too. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know that. That's nice. Yeah, whatever you post a link. Like, say, if you post a link, it could be uh, related to cooking. Anything like a cooking video. Once you post that link in your video and your subscribers follow it, you get the view time for that link too. Wow, that's neat. So yeah, that's a neat thing. So say they you post the link and then they go, to, like say I post your link, like I just post your channel. That's Alger's channel. And say they somebody go watch your channel and they watch one of your videos and then after watching one of your videos, another video pop up and it might be from another person. We all are gonna get view time because of that. Dang. <laughs> it's like yeah, you know, I'm still in the, in the lower end of things. You know, I, I'm still learning, you know, <laughs> as I, I go I along. I, you know why I learned that from? Because people, you know, you ever ran into like a channel and all they got is playlists 
they yeah. only make videos. All they got is playlists. I'm like, why did they got playlists and stuff like that? And that's why they got the playlist because you know they have all these views from their playlist or uh, stuff they recommend. Dang. Post my link, the real. I post your link, the real. You guys follow clean, clean Android. <laughs> I always post your stuff, real. <laughs> It's in the description, the real. <laughs> yeah, it's in the description. And then when she goes live, I'll be at work too when she live. Bo. What's up, bro? What's up? What's up? When she's oh, live, really? I'll I'll share I share her live stream on the community tab. Every time, well, not every time. When I catch her. Because I'll be at work. What's up, Bo? Chilling. What's good? Cause I be I be a, at work, and I dropped a couple dollars. The real. What are you doing? I dropped a couple dollars. Real money. The real. You know I stopped making videos for a while. <laughs> Steve, what you what you doing? What you been doing videos on, Steve? I I, been, I honestly I had slowed down. I slowed down for like two months, and I was just doing a live show. I'm just now starting to post again. I'll do. I for the last two months, I was posting a video every blue moon. Oh, you know, I was just watching wow. stuff, and then uh, once stuff calmed down, I started coming back. But I'm just gonna come back differently. Okay. My approach, you know, you, you know how YouTube, YouTube always with the, uh, you know, especially when they start clapping channels, right? And uh, you just gotta look at what's going on. You know, change. You know, might have to change some titles. Might have to change some tags and stuff like that. Yeah, they really on like the titles of things. Like that's why I had to change a couple of my videos. It was simply I got a copyright strike simply because of the title, and I was like, "Wait you a minute, copyright strike?" Yeah, because of the title of a video. I said, "No, no, no." I said, Wait, "Let me." And I looked at it. I said, "Really?" So I changed it, but I mean, it it still stuck. So I just played it out. So I was kind of a uh, chill for a couple months. I had to be real, real careful on what exactly I would do a video. <laughs> Uh, two, they got me two, um, two strikes. I said, "Wait a minute, huh?" Yeah. But you know, I didn't really fight it or nothing. I didn't know how to, so I just said, "I'll just be careful." You know, the, uh, so you still you still have them then? No, I deleted them. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm talking about the strikes. Did they 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 uh, take them down then? Once you delete the video, ninety days. I haven't looked. I just know I'm being extra careful. I haven't really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you gotta be careful. Yeah, yeah no, I think kids channels because the kids channels they wasn't even doing nothing wrong. They demonetized the kids channels because of com comments from other people. I was like, how you gonna uh penalize a creator because of comments? That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> so it's weird. <laughs> yeah, the real makes some nice video. This yeah, Bono, y'all yeah, can subscribe yeah. to Bono's. Yeah, real. Yeah, she made real good videos. Like A6. I haven't tested the Samsung A6 yet, Brad. I don't think I have. What you say, Bo? No, I was saying real make real good videos. Real is man. Yeah. She gets in the. She get in there. I got to get back to doing some videos. Actually. I gotta get back to doing it too. I've been just going live crazy too. I gotta get some videos in as well. I see you acting up over there, um, Mr. Mayfield. I see you to my turn around. I see your name hitting my screen. I'm like, look at uh Aldrin acting up. My bad. <laughs> nah, keep it up. Keep it up. Now, if you doing what you're doing, everybody getting everybody getting that teaching, they getting that knowledge. Do your thing. Yeah, I'm trying. Oh, the yeah, somebody gotta put it out there. I haven't played with this one yet. Yeah, I was gonna say the same thing. Bravo uh, uh, actually gave some good information uh, information for you, uh, Arjun. Get with checking about them. 
as far as their strikes go. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know he got away from a few of them. <laughs> I think they, they just said something. I think it was like they said three months or something, and then they'll disappear or something. So it's been – it's been – it's at least been a few months. I'm going to have to hop back on there to look, though, see what my status is. There was older videos or recent videos you had recently did, and they hit? Uh, one of them was an older video. And then um, – so pretty much, like, anything with, like, live TV and stuff, like, I got rid of <laughs> just being safe, you know what I'm saying? Like, anything – because that's the thing, too, what they were going back to, a lot of people – they go back to watch older videos, and if you mention like the Sly channels, you know, uh, that's the one thing. thing. That's the one thing I don't like because why is they penalizing you on stuff that's a year or two years old? Right. Yeah, because I know Dale said he they try to get him one for an old one. I believe it was an old old video, two years old or something like that. And that's that's just it's just crazy. <laughs> That's back then, though, when we would show everything. <laughs> yeah, you should at least, you know, if they change the stuff, they need to, they need to allow you to change with it. But that's well, not true, right? Yeah, okay, it was cool back then, but hey, you got to delete it now, Steve. Well, yeah, the I mean, date, yeah, the date that they're doing it, then they say from here back to whatever date we giving you such a time to delete. Yeah, but they like going down. Somewhere. They can go anywhere. They can go five years back if they want to. Right, I mean, I'll remove the video, but just let me know first. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's the thing. They, yeah, let a person know. <laughs> they're just like, well, you got a strike from this video. I'm looking like, damn, was I drunk that night when I did that video? Like, I don't even <laughs> remember this shit. Like, <laughs> How often do you use Cody 18? Are you still using Cody 17.6 way more? Yeah, I use Cody 17.6. Yeah. I only use Cody 18 where I'm pretty much just testing it. It just works still. It just yeah. yeah. <laughs> Eighteen is not all the way all the way good yet, right? They still mess I mean, with the kinks and bugs. No, I mean what works. I'm saying they still mess with the bugs on it, right? Yeah, hundred percent. It, with every version, whatever they first release a version, it take about yeah. to point three, point four until. It's... Yeah, cause seventeen point six. That was a pretty high number. Cause I I don't think what was sixteen. Did sixteen get up that high? Uh, uh I think sixteen. Uh, I got to like six point four, I believe. Like three or four. Yeah, I believe the last one I did at sixteen, I think, was four. That I remember. Yeah, because mm -hmm. fifteen only got to like three, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, six seventeen was a high number. <laughs> <coughs> but all the other ones before, because when I remember when I jumped from fifteen to sixteen, it was like almost the same thing. It wasn't really too much of a difference to me. 17 was a difference. 18, you can feel it. You know, it's different. It's going to yeah. be nice once it's finished. Yeah, it's fast, too, real fast. <laughs> like, even the loading screen or whatever, like, even on a fire stick, you can just tell. Like, Yeah, I like I like that you could just do stuff on one screen, too. Instead of you got to jump back here, jump back there. That's why I like the most. Steve, did you ever post a blah, 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 a jailbreak silo, PS4? For no, I haven't. No, I haven't. Ain't no, you can't, you can't uh, load Cody into PS4. And oh. PS4 is suing people who jailbroke it. Yeah, ain't that crazy? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's I, that. I was like, man, that's nuts. Who, uh, what they would added like the the games and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. They yeah. suing people. Well, I don't know. This is a fit. I heard. I seen an ad. I didn't look to it that much, but I know I seen the ad. What them talking about it? Where is the Terrarium TV build? Somebody asked about. There's a Terrarium TV build. Yeah, there was. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna say it was one. I did a video on it actually. It's, it's gone. What's the name had it? Um, oh yeah, I remember it now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. What repo he had? <clears throat> Steve making me think. I know what you're talking about. I, I had it. I ended up doing a video on it. And they was like tripping off of it. Jesus TV repo. Jesus box repo. Oh, yeah. That's gone. Yeah, that's gone. <laughs> What's a good four for 17.6 G Smitty? They got about 20 of them. <laughs> they got a lot of them, G Smitty. Mm -hmm. um, 
I think I got like ten of them. Well, I got like at least five of them. Out of streams. In the foul lane. Oh, I'm fouling. Oh, in your foul lane. Eight's got some uh, seventeen point six forks. Uh, Supreme Bills. They got like nine of them. Yeah, they got tons. <laughs> yeah, I thought that's what you were saying, but you were saying your foul lane. But yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Fire TV girl has some more. I don't know. I don't think he got his forks up no more. Uh, Demetrology, uh, I believe, has just a regular fork too. Like with no, there's no wizard or nothing in it. It's just a regular, regular fork. I think on his website, Dem Demetrology. I think. Yeah, Demi. Yeah, Demi. Yeah, Demi. Yeah. Demi. Where he been at? Um, he been doing videos. He just ain't been doing a lot. He been doing them. I've been uh, seeing his notification every now and then too. Oh, he's been doing some videos too. Yeah, he did a couple. And then they know about the thirteen clowns. If they have it, it's still up. They still can use it. Anyone's real not anything. working. It was working yesterday, Cedilia. Try reauthorizing it. Try reauthorize your real debris and uh resolve URL and the URL resolver. And then if it's still not working, check your account to make sure you still have a uh, service. Check your account and make sure that it expire. <laughs> yeah, like me. I said, <laughs> why am I still working, man? Like, damn. <laughs> Just expired. Oh, okay. Well, that makes they, sense. They like still that. show you the links. You don't know expire. <laughs> They said they're getting rid of Google Hangouts too, Al. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So what That's are they going to use then? <laughs> How you going to go live? Like, what do you? It, it, We're you just got to go use OBS. Live. OBS. That's stupid though, because it's like these. We like your. We your creators. Mm -hmm. but, but I know a lot of people use Google Hangouts, so you would think that they would try to at least make an alternative. For the people that's making them money, mm. but they're <laughs> supposedly gonna have a paid version. Thanks, Dora Sweets, for the six dollars super chat. So they're getting rid of the Google Plus, then too, right? Yeah, all, all the Google Plus groups and stuff. Yeah, yeah, that's gone. And there's some huge groups there. Yeah, they really didn't take advantage of it, you know, because it, it, everybody. You think they would uh, try to? They would have marked them better. Yeah, because it had a lot of features. Yeah, you think they would have like marketed like Facebook or something? Because uh everybody got a Google account. So you mm -hmm. probably would have had more members because they got some huge groups, but it's just they didn't put nothing into it, no effort. Mm -hmm. Let's see. I'm going to read your comments. Did any of y'all shields update? Yeah, 7.2. Nah, they said they got a 7.2. Oh, no, I didn't. Nah, I didn't get that one. I just yeah. did the 7.2 today. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry I didn't get one. Have me go to my shield and check. Because I ain't, I ain't opened it up today. They probably they probably a beta tester. They kicked me off. They kicked you off, thing? <laughs> yeah. Oh, and you showed a little something too early or something or what? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that ain't right. But you know, I know I can help it now because uh you got people complaining and stuff, and then I showed it to people, be like, and then I gave them a shout out, hey, they gonna fix this. So they had messaged me, and when they messaged me, they pretty much like Steve. Uh, we didn't want you to show that, you know. We <laughs> wanted to just give it to you so you could t <laughs> test it, <clears throat> let us know the bugs. And I was like, it's hard not to share the information when y'all mess something up and it's not working correctly, and then. You know, you brought up all the updates, so I'm like giving people cookies so they don't go crazy over the stuff you messed up. You know, so it is what it is. Yeah.
Wasn't getting no money for it. <laughs> yeah, I thought they would have been giving you something. That's crazy. No. They didn't give me a penny. Everything I got, I paid for with it. No free so, game. Yeah. That's the problem, too, I had with it, too, because they'll contact you when uh, you they feel you did something they didn't like, but you never contact me and say, hey, Steve, here goes a free game or something. We know you, you know, reviewing our stuff. But they let you know they're at least watching because they're contacting you when something's going on. That they, they don't like what you do. <laughs> mm. But you know, it's, that's a lot of companies now too because it's pretty much free advertisement for them. Right. They save thousands off uh, YouTubers. Mm -mm. So, who's your favorite? Do you actually do you watch YouTubers still? Do you got somebody that you follow? Um, I, I can't say who my favorite. As far as what the genre? Yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, do you? Because I watch other stuff. stuff. Yeah. See, one of my favorites right now is Tech Doctor. He's he's. <laughs> Tech he's kind of quick good. talking. He's a little funny, and but he's been putting out a lot of good information, like about like retro gaming and stuff. He did a, quite a few of those little videos. Yeah. And, uh, oh yeah, the retro game video. I like uh on the retro game side. I think uh on the retro game side, I think ETA Prime's. Yeah, thing. yeah, ETA Prime is my uh, that's my favorite favorite. Yeah, he uh, he knows the stuff. And then I, the rest of the stuff, I'll be watching like the real more uh, the t uh, texts like Marquis. I watch him. Then I'll be watching other stuff. You know, you be getting lost watching stuff you don't even think you'll watch. <laughs> yeah. I was watching hunting videos. <laughs> <laughs> One day I was like, I was like, I don't even go hunting. Why is I'm watching hunting and videos and fishing well, videos. <laughs> i was watching these one hunting videos though it, it just it got I, I was actually in cody though and <laughs> this dude had a hawk like that, that it would chill on his shoulder and they would go in the woods and that hawk would spot something and then he'd make a little noise or whatever feed him a little something and that hawk would go after it like a rabbit and and kill it and then they'd eat it together it's <laughs> And I was stuck watching it like, dang, what? Like, I don't, I know I don't smoke weed, but this is just interesting. Man. Like, I was watching what's the name? Um, Dear Meat for Dinner. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, one of his videos popped up. I watched them and um, I kept on watching it because this guy was driving <laughs> off boats and grabbing these crabs and the and cooking. He was good, he'll cook it, he'll, he'll catch them, clean them, and he'll cook them. Uh, oh. yeah. So I'm like, good, man. Deer meat is good. Y'all ever try it? Ooh, that deer jerky. Yeah, deer's good. Uh and Peter, Peter's real good. Peter Ooh. Peter McKinnon. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Peter's good. Peter McKinnon, he can't got like a million subscribers in like five months. <laughs> the older guy? Nah, he's a younger guy. He's our age. Come on, Peter. You talking about the other Peter Bowser? Yeah, you know who I'm talking about, the older yeah, yeah, guy. Yeah, yeah. yeah, no, I'm talking about the uh this guy, he's like the photo guy. He do cameras and stuff like that, the Peter McKinnon. But he'll go like take a trip. But uh he just his way is filming, it's nice. I'll be like, man, I wish I could do that. He says Steve's favorite Machenka. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever talk to her? Huh? You ever talk to her? A couple times, man. A couple times. <laughs> hey guys, my I talked to her a couple times, man. Make so, yeah. Not she actually, she actually replied back to you. I didn't think she did, but she do. Steve, do you know if the Alexa app can link with the Echo Dot? I thought so. Can, yeah, it does, Steve. 
does. Yes. Yes, it does. I would think so. Does anyone with premiumized me have trouble playing 4K? And it was buffering. It could be the source, Marcus. It could be the source. If the source is bad, then it, you know, ain't no help in it. Yeah, I think that's one of the things, too. People think, like, if they have real debris, that they're never going to get buffering on any links. Uh, you can still. Think, <laughs> yeah. Like they think that if they're paying for it, I, I shouldn't have any links buffering. Mm -mm. It's not the case. Especially not this cheap. But it is nice. You don't use real debris yet, Aldra? Uh I mean I used it and then once it run <laughs> ran out, I just was like I mean APKs were like on fire during that time. So it was like yeah, it was got a little used to it. You know what I'm saying? And I was like, and then Cody and, and all these new uh add-ons that was coming out i really just never went back to it you know plus my schedule got a little busy i was like well hell i just as long as i can find what i'm looking for and i use a lot of the one click um you know add-ons too so like i'm finding like pretty much everything i need uh, except for the classic stuff you know like if i'm looking for something old old school then i just use retro you know retro quest for that so Got a oh, message from YouTube saying notification widget is going to be gone on 3719. Notification widget. I'm not sure about that. I didn't see that. They're talking about the oh, bell yeah. where people get notified when you drop a video. Yeah. Huh. Wow. That's weird. Yeah. But you know, the stuff that they're doing is kind of, <laughs> yeah, it hurt us, but it's hurting you. Yeah. <laughs> I don't get it. You know the yeah, that don't make sense because you want people to view. So why wouldn't you? I'm gonna have to look that up. But you know what it could be? It's a lot of people complaining about their their people that's uh notify you know that's uh supposed to get notified. A lot of people are not getting notified. So it could be broken where they don't know how to fix it. Mm -hmm. But I'd rather still some people get a notification than no one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you at that really didn't go for the specific time that we actually go on. Mm -hmm. right, we have actually have to know what time we go on. That's weird. I'm gonna have to look that up. Yeah, I think uh, Machanga does. Um... Somebody says she does motivational videos now. I haven't seen any, I, unless I'm not getting the notifications from her. Has she did videos in a while? Um, I saw her like when she went away, and I saw her come back like she that one time. But since then, I haven't seen anything. She did a video with a cat on it. Hmm. She has stopped. She has stopped around December too, when they had stopped started doing all that stuff. She stopped and she deleted a lot of stuff. <laughs> and that was Aldrin, y'all. That was not me. That was Aldrin. I was reading that comment. <laughs> so I was Aldrin. Aldrin. Just a, it was just a lighthearted impression. No, I was just playing with it. <laughs> she did one video this month. Uh, somebody said she's pregnant. How do y'all know she's pregnant? They ain't never saying the how they know she pregnant. Yeah, that's somebody. That's what I said. I, I know she pregnant. Did she say she's pregnant? Man, the internet is undefeated. <laughs> <laughs> it could be anything on the internet. They like, uh-uh. She had a cat on her. Yeah, she had a cat. She was doing like a relaxing type video. They don't care what type of video she do. They just came to sit here, hear her voice. Her voice. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the four dollars super check, Dora. She pregnant. 
Yeah, you got it. I'm looking like, <laughs> like how you know she's pregnant. Y'all know something. For we the don't record, know. guys, we don't know if she's pregnant, so don't go. <laughs> Talking about, we heard on Steven show that yeah. she's pregnant. So <laughs> the next thing, but don't get Steven, don't get Steve in trouble, y'all. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, she's cool though. Like I, I learned a lot from her videos. I was like, man, she knows how to really entice uh, some people. You know, that's how you bring them in. You know, you gotta, you gotta be soft spoken and mm -hmm. be like very me, thorough too. She like she wouldn't like, do like practice a video before she do a video. Yeah, or maybe she got a little thing, something wrote out or something. Don't it? Cause don't it seem like it's scripted when she be talking? It just seemed perfect. Man, don't it? I'm <laughs> like, what the? I'm messing up, screwing up. I'm like, get it. Let me go into the next part. She like, da -da 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 -da. Yeah, that's with every you know YouTube. You know, you gonna have some mistakes here, but with hers, it's like perfect perfection. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I wonder if she actually like, um, maybe she rehearsed it or something, <laughs> ripped it off. <laughs> It's funny, but it's true though. It seemed true the way what Steve yeah, said. It all, and she probably did it like three or four times. Times. she probably got a list, or you know, they got them screens sometimes that pop up and let you know what to say. Because mm -hmm. it's like never a mistake. Yeah, she just it's not, like, not to make a mistake. A teleprompter. I mean, she probably you know edits good too though. I mean, I can tell her, her she got very good. Video quality, like for me, I don't edit videos. Yeah, <laughs> like if I mess up, I gotta start all the way over again. Yeah. I need, you know, I'm gonna have to start working, like, cause I want to do some new things. I'm gonna have to work on my editing. Okay, but uh, yeah, she probably, but still, even she editing to be so per per perfect, she yeah. got all of that. Oh yeah, look, he, look, John, John, he still, he like she on maternity leave. He's still at it. <laughs> yeah, he don't know maternity leave. But she never <laughs> did many videos anyway, too. Right. Yeah. So you, she pop out with two videos, maybe a month, maybe. Because yeah. people usually, you know, she had a fan base. It was, you know, some of them cool, and they'd be like. Yeah, Steve, what was this? You sound then you had some of them, it was going crazy. Like, Steve, you copying off Machanka. I was like, How I'm copying off Machanka? She's not even making videos. <laughs> <laughs> but uh they'll be like, Okay, you made a build, she did the same. I was like, everybody probably did this build, you know, mm -hmm. reviewed the bill. <laughs> yeah, that's one of my things I was getting sick of is like only being able to review builds from a certain team. And yeah. That's one of my reasons why I had to move along to, so, uh, you know, I shouldn't have to be restricted because I was a YouTuber first, so I'm going to be able to review anything. Y'all got some builds. Well, I mean, it shouldn't have to be connected because it's two different things. Right, right. When I look I totally at agree. it. I totally agree, Steve. I totally agree. Mm -hmm. So your YouTube is what they say, YouTube, you, yeah, right. <laughs> what you want to do. <laughs> yeah, it should be. Oh, she actually had builds? Really? No, she never had no builds. Oh, she, 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 turned, she turned them on to Mr. Mons. Where do you she had builds at? Somebody, uh, Mina B, she said she had a few builds. No, she had a build. She had a skin that she'll show every once in a while. Oh, and yeah, had, yeah. Had <laughs> I bet she had a million followers. She had close to it. Mm -hmm. She well, hit him. It's close to it. Yeah, she hit him. I think she has, she had the most. She had the most. I think she had her and Cody No Limits had it. Maybe her and Electrical MD probably got the most right now. Mm -hmm. Electrical MD, Lord have mercy. He grows like a uh, hundred thousand a month. <laughs> her, 
yeah, her really. voice and <laughs> me and we so thirsty. We just hear the voice part and be like, I'm I'm subscribing. <laughs> Hi guys, and you like, oh, click subscribe. <laughs> I get retro quest. She was my first YouTuber I started with. Look, he burned. He said, "Are she running from CPS?" He's <laughs> he burned. Oh, Chris, uh, you you could go to my channel, Chris. I got all that there. I don't know if he wants me to put all that here. So, what is it? The uh, retro quest. They asking about retro quest. But if you want to put a link, you can get the views off of it. Then that's a different story. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, where's you um I you still got retro quest? Yeah. Oh, that was different from from everything else. Are oh, you talking about envy? No, I'm saying I'm saying your yo no, I'm saying your is it was different from yo from you being with, with the with you being with, with Eternal. That's two different things then, right? Oh yeah, no, completely different. They was never they was never together. Yeah, it was oh, okay. yeah, that's what I was saying. I, I thought it was all one thing. Guys. What's up, XTC Tex? What was that, Steve? He's XC Tex. No, 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 no. What, what hey, YouTube. That's our uh, algebra page. Oh, okay, I'll go there. Let me read these comments. Pootie Pie got 88 million. He got that many now? Who? Oh, oh Pewdie Pie. What's Pewdie the name? He the biggest. Dang, 88 million? Yeah, because you know he started it. They he though know, he was one of the first people that started with it. I've never even heard of that dude. I got I guess I gotta head over there. I never heard of him until last year. Never heard of him. Wow. But, I guess he should have. I mean, if he was the first one to start releasing stuff. Yeah, he was like one of the first ones who started making videos back there. When YouTube first started. He was doing gaming, look gaming videos, but now he just can do anything. Somebody asking about free, I, I believe it's free. They're talking about, can you put more live TV APKs in your file link? Thanks. I mean, um, <laughs> uh, I kind of want to try to stay, depends. Depends, Patrick. Because the thing is, it, a lot of them won't be inconsistent, and then I'll have to keep on hearing from it. <laughs> yeah. And then the pants. We might, Patrick. And then I don't want to get the uh, file link too, too kind of hot either. If it can get hot, I don't know if it can or can't. <laughs> How long you have your file link, Steve? We like for a while? few weeks? No, a couple weeks. Oh, okay. Well, nah, Steve, you good. You good. I, I didn't trust me. Mine got beat up and ran over and all other kind of stuff. You good. My first video watching Fire Stick was Machanga. All they all talk about Machanga now. <laughs> See what you started out here? No, I'm just playing. <laughs> just playing out What build works, works best in South Africa? Please help for Ann. Uh, they all pretty much will work the same. Pretty much depends on your your network. What builds is best? Best build. I mean, I don't know. It depends on your personal preference, And I mean, are they looking for like African channels? Maybe. I don't know. Looking, like, yeah, that's <laughs> going to be. <laughs> I've had a couple, like I've seen a few African channels and uh, I, I want to say it was in um, uh, actually this uh, film on, I think film on had a few. Yeah, they still yeah film on got some. Yeah. As far as free concern. Yeah, yeah. Free. Still kicking? Film on, film on still kicking? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. They've been around a long time. I've been using that for years. Just It's just free entertainment man if you just want to get in there just to browse like even the sports section it's not like you know obviously live or new sports but it's it's different like sometimes they got like the cheap wrestling in there you know some of the like wrestling matches it looks like it's in a basement and stuff so it's like it, it's it's interesting sometimes you can have a little fun in there watching what's night could have got big well still may 
Well, they finalized mm -hmm. the deal yesterday. So uh, Viacom completely uh -huh. owns Pluto now. Oh yeah, Pluto is is yeah. Pluto going to end up being being sick. I hope they okay. at least keep a free version though. Yeah, because I'm enjoying no, that. Pluto, um, I was hoping because the Pluto grew nice, so I don't know. Maybe they'll keep like a, a free version, and then they'll have a premium version too, with the Viacom channels. Because it works fantastic in Cody. Like, yeah, it, I mean, man, because you can link it inside of your builds and stuff and that's what i use right now i mean it works you can link it with the uh what's the app called tv what's it called tv uh tv make who tv make which, which one tv who uh, the the regular tv live channels live channels yeah yeah, yeah. Like it with live oh, channels. Oh, TV. oh okay okay the live channels app is gonna be real nice once they uh develop it for a while yeah because you could put multiple sources on it. I got to give me that antenna thing that you had that I think it was called the size. I get the I got the hall pitch. Get the uh yeah, that's what it is. Get the home run in. Cuz your home run in, you could put multiple TVs. I think the home run in, you could use three TVs. I only got the hall pitch for the review, but it only worked for one TV. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. yeah. But that, but that hooks straight to your shield. Doesn't the other thing, the the home run, you need a PC too, right? I don't think so. I'm gonna have to check it out. Yeah, I wanted right. to buy. I didn't. I, I might have to buy it. I didn't really want to buy it, but I might have to buy it. <laughs> I mean, we don't need it, but it's nice to try it out. You yeah, know? it's nice to try it out. Give it a little test. <laughs> That's weird, man. I'm gonna definitely look up that notification thing. Cause it just don't sound right. It sound crazy. What's up, Clinton? Now I haven't tried that yet. Oh, I missed that dude's put. He said, uh, where can we get Alice Flicks? It's it's in the um Chef's Wizard, Diggs, Dig Chef Wizard. And then I messed up too. So K Coppin, I, I did a video today. Well, I walked through it today on, on Hustle TV's channel. But I, I'm gonna do a video on it too pretty soon. Abyss was good too. He's still yeah, Abyss about to hit a million subscribers. Probably next year. Abyss will hit a million. His his uh, he his fifty thousand. Huh? When I started watching him, he had 50,000 subscribers. I didn't even know about him <laughs> until like last year, and he had a bunch of subscribers. But, you know, he his editing skills. If you yeah. edit real good, you could grow. Yes. What's the name getting I got to start too. editing more, too. He's got CK a little TV. comedy in there, too. Huh? CKTV is actually pretty good, too. Who? CKTV. CK TV, CK. I don't know him. No, 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 no. It's a, it's an app. It's an app. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm looking for the YouTube name. I got ten viewers on G Smitty. I mean, it, it takes time, G Smitty. And and I think it's harder now too, because before all this stuff, was, it was just. I think it was just a whole lot easier to grow back in the day than it is now. Cause now it's, uh, it's just a whole lot harder. So, but I mean, you gotta start. Everybody started from zero. How do you get Pluto TV and Cody? It's actually available in the uh, official Cody repository. Yeah. So if you got Cody installed, you got access to the Pluto TV add-on. I believe it should still. Yeah, the last time I checked. My notification works all the time, plus reminder from Michael. Yeah, some people who say their notifications work, there's some people be like, Steve, my notification's not working. But the way YouTube do it too, because you know, they got they, the way they do notification, it's weird, because they go by like your last three watch videos. As far as what what you was 
if you was watching more sports then it's crazy it's hard to explain <coughs> yeah because i didn't watch like a gaming video and then after that that's all i see for a while <laughs> that's all you see for a while so it yeah. depends what they think you're interested in Tableau. Anybody have? T I never tried the Tableau. Yeah, it's a fantastic interface. Like it does look nice, but I don't want anything that I gotta pay for. Still, <laughs> like if I'm if I'm just using it to watch my, you know, local antenna channels, I don't want to have to pay for it. And I think it's either that or something else you pay. I, I, I want to oh, say Tableau, you gotta pay for. There's something you have to pay for. I, I'm not sure if it's the tablet. You know, HD home run like that, too, because you got to pay for the recording feature, I think. Yeah, maybe that's what it is, something like that. But you don't know how much you don't got to pay. Yeah, that's what, that's what I like that for. When I seen yeah. that review, I was like, damn, I got to get that. I want to test that out. Thanks for and the $2 the super chat, Ben. I mean, it's personal preference, man. Mm -hmm. They both good. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's what's up, Cody, man. Congrats. Saying, saying to my hubby, Harper's not the only player who got a $300 million contract. I think Manny Mac how you say it? Mercado. Mercado had that, too. Yeah, he got paid. Them baseball players getting paid. Yeah, they make more than NFL player. Yeah. That's why I was surprised because, you know, the one guy was drafted – was going to NFL draft. He was drafted high in baseball, but he said he wanted to play football. And I was like, if I had to choose, I think I'd play baseball because you can make more money and I could protect my body. <laughs> yep. Somebody said you answering questions here or not. Wow. <laughs> Ouch. What, what question? What question? Re, re, if he if he missed your question, guys, repost it. He might have just missed it. Ada Galler, <laughs> Ada Galler, man, I, I think you're pretty much getting everything answered here, my man. I don't know. Um, I, I haven't seen no question from him, but Stephen been answering every question though, as far as I, I'm looking at. Yeah, I don't see. I see it. The two memory sticks can use two memory sticks. What you mean? <laughs> uh, USB. If you mean two two forms of external storage, yeah. Is he talking about maybe plugged into the same box, like two? Shield, both of them, both of them plugged into the shield. Yeah, you can. Would you just so he can see it, or yeah, you can. <laughs> we don't know the reason. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And you get it on me. You didn't say the question right. <laughs> Can you use two? Yes. Steve, do you yeah. use Plex server on your ship? No, I don't, Sam. I use Plex, but I don't use the Plex server. You use your Plex server? Bo? No, no, uh, no. I got mine. What I did just ask me that is now too. I got mine to my on my PC right now. I don't use my Plex server. I know Dale did at one point with his, with his. So, um, Real did at one point too. I don't know if Real still is, but I know they did at one point. Um, and it, it stays on. I mean, it didn't go to sleep. We all know that it didn't go to sleep, but it still play play player Plex. I heard Envy is really like updating a lot lately. I like haven't really even tried it, MB. It the look of it's beautiful. Like it's that's what that that's the fork. That's they they have fork of uh plants. Yeah, it's it's really, really nice. Hey, see you, Caesar. Yeah, nice Caesar. Have a good night. Thanks for thanks for um see getting Steve. some of this knowledge from, from Steve. I have a 32 gigabyte in now and won't recognize my other stick. What do you mean? It could be the stick. It could be the stick, Atogato. But you could, uh, these are both external USB flash drive, whatever you're using. 
Yeah, I was gonna say that too. It could be whatever stick you're using. One of them might not be recognizable. Or maybe the port. Have you tried moving? Could be the port. Switching port. the ports around. Yeah, you can try that too. You gotta do process of elimination. Or it could. What does it gotta be? Uh, it don't have to be Fed Thirty Two, do it? Mm -mm. No, I don't think so. Not for memory. No. And not for external. Did. Not for yeah. If he's got three point oh, I mean, if he's plugging a two point oh. You know, memory stick in there. I don't. That's not gonna work either. Like, right? Ain't that right? Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah you're right. You're right. Because yeah. when I was first setting up my um my screen capture, I had bought the the 3.0 Elgato screen capture, and I plugged it into my computer, not knowing that it was only 2.0. I'm like, oh man, I done bought a jank one. But it come to find out, you have to have the specific hookup. You know, you can't be plugging in a 3.0 cord into a 2.0 thinking everything's going to work right for you. So I had to send that back and get, get the I it backwards. Uh, previous version. I, Is it, I, I, don't know. I just know that I have bought the newer version of the Elgato screen capture um. and it would not work on my laptop. And then so I went to the, the lower version and, and that, that worked. So I, it was something about because when I plugged it in, it was saying something about you got to have 3.0 or something. I'm like, what? I don't think this laptop has it. Mm -mm. You got a um, you got a Plex though, don't you? Andrew? You do too, don't you, Steve? Yeah, no, I, I use it. Plex. I use it. Oh, okay. I don't got not enough time to work in it though. No. No, I don't got enough time for all that. <laughs> the way real, um, the way real has been helping me is actually been. I ain't really been having to do too much. I mean, even though I do most of my movies on my phone, I get most of them on my phone. But the way she been having me do it, I kind of like it because I can do it like on my phone, but I can have it sent to my computer. Oh, really? Yeah. So the way she had me doing it, I actually like it, Steve. I mean, the way she, I'm about to probably show it to you, or she probably have to show it to you too, like how she how she got it set up. But I do it like from my phone, like what I want, and it comes straight to my computer. Name brand. Good night, Jay Sullivan. I don't think it needs to be a name brand. I think it, you can. For what? Oh, can you give me a name brand? Okay. Oh, he said, can you give me a name brand? 3.0, 128, or 256 gig for my NVIDIA Shield SanDisk. I don't use uh, USB flash drives that big. I honestly use. For that big, I usually just get me a, 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 a external hard drive. External? Yeah, I yeah. just get me a external hard drive because you know the speed's faster, mm -hmm. so, and it, then it's cheap anyway. Because you can get your external hard drive for about fifty bucks, a terabyte. Between fifty to sixty, you can get you uh the Seagate or the Western Digital. Mm -hmm. I have a Samsung 64 gigabyte 3.0 that works for the Shield 3.0 and my laptop just slower on the laptop from Jerry Hartman. Thanks yeah, like SD cards are getting cheaper nowadays though, but yeah, still it still be cheaper to you know they get still, an external. I, I don't know. They might. Yeah, I, I haven't really checked them. I haven't checked them since I messed up my Shield. I messed <laughs> up my Shield when I first got one because the uh. Speed the match for, for, for so for for then uh since then I uh started getting the hard drives unless I just had you know a sixteen gigabyte here I had yeah I did have like a hundred twenty eight gigabyte um SD one for my phone though yeah you still got the original shield too don't you yeah yeah that's what I got. Too so because that's the only one with the SD. People keep asking about that. The, the the original, the first shield has the SD card slot. The newer ones do not, right? No, unless they, don't, the, unless they get the pro version. The pro yeah, version has it. But the um, <laughs> they didn't want people using those SD cards for, for external store. I mean, internal storage, using it for uh, the memory. Yeah, like I did when I first had mine. I messed it up.
I'm looking it up right now. Look at the prices. Well, they're not too expensive. They got some SanDisk that's 128 gigabyte for $22. Oh, yeah, real. I just posted one for a 10 terabyte, which I missed it up. I'm going to try to see if I can catch this, another sale like that. It was like for one, 143 or something for a 10 terabyte. Ooh. I'm going to load that bad boy up with some games and put on put it on high. Man, so it was a one day sale though. It was only a one day sale. Jeez. Man, is that that part? I finally got my first subscriber. How do I thank them on my YouTube channel? So excited. Ooh. Thank them on your video. <laughs> okay. Who was that? G Smitty. Oh, G Smitty. I finally got my do you a Nas run to run K Coppin? He asked you both because I don't do it. What do you what do you ask? Do you use uh, Nas to I guess he said, do you a Nas to run Plex or just use? Oh, let me go back and ask. Um, who who answered yeah. it? Who answered it? For storage for your Plex. Do you have a, a, a Nas? No, I don't have a Nas. I don't use a Nas. But Nas are Nas are always good to use. But I don't I don't use one. I just use the external. Are you sure? And tell everybody if you use a higher terabyte hard drive, it takes longer for you it to start up on our. Are you sure? Tell higher terabyte hard. It takes longer for it to start up or use it for. I don't mind understanding that party lead 007, but it shouldn't take longer to for you I to get it. Terabyte. Huh? I just use a ter. I, I don't know. Well, I, got a, I, got a boy. Boy. I got a four terabyte. And mine don't take longer. It it depends on what you're doing too, because you might not need a four terabyte. Because I honestly will never fill up my terabyte. For me, I'm I'm almost my four is almost filled up. You almost filled up because he's doing a lot more. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm doing a whole lot more of mine. Trust <laughs> me. I'm doing a whole lot more of mine. The average person's not going to use up a terabyte unless you actually, you know, downloading the movies and stuff. Right, yeah. I got movies, TV shows. I got everything. I'm just on mine. Because I know, I think, um, like, an eight terabyte drive can fit, like, all the PlayStation 3 games. If so you think it's something like that. <laughs> What you say you got, Al? No, uh, when I was researching, like, as far as games, like, s some people sell the external drives with all the games and stuff on them. Yeah. And you can get, like, an 8 terabyte with all the PlayStation 3 games. Yeah. So, just kind of, you know, if you're looking for something like that, then you're going to want something more if you're into, like, you want yeah. all the collections or, yeah, you know. But that, that's why I think Raspberry Pi is just – still a fantastic way to to and the most cheapest way to enjoy retro gaming because you can get a little 256 um sd card get your little raspberry pi kit you know everything for under like 150 and just have the best retro gaming experience around i mean that, that's just me it, though it, of course it, it depends though because they still won't be able to do what we do as far as some of the emulators yeah, because you got some people playing what they played. I never played it, but they they using Dolphin for the shield. You could even use yeah Dolphin on the shield. So that's why some people just get the shield. But it's like if you want everything already together for you, because oh, yeah, yeah. It, it even comes with like Cody too. But you know they doing shields like that too. Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> you no, know, on eBay they doing a lot of stuff. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yeah, hyperspin <laughs> on the shield is is yeah, phenomenal. I, I I don't need to do all that. I but mean, I'm not gonna do it. Yeah. <laughs> it's good. Some hyperspin groups I could recommend you to. Yeah. But I'm not into it as much. He said my four terabyte resting digital takes ten minutes to go through the startup. How? Something something's hot. Yeah, something's wrong. Is wrong. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't take that long. Yeah, there's something uh you got a bad hookup somewhere or something. Ten minutes? Yeah, that's a long time. Nah, something wrong. 
Because people use a lot, because I'm in some groups, people using eight terabytes. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, something don't don't seem right on that connection there. I'm back. You miss me. Hey Kathleen. Of course we miss you. Rudolph said I got eight terabyte Seagate backup plus. It's what I have for my Plex. For me, I just I don't need none of that stuff. I just I just stream, you know. If I really <laughs> <laughs> For me, I, well, that's cool. Some people do, you know. But <laughs> I would like to have a collection, though. That would be nice. But hey, yeah, man, that's just, another reason why I do what I do. As far as me, I want my own collection, and then when my yeah. peoples want to share it, I can be able to share it to them. Yeah, so that'd be nice. Yeah, I got quite a bit of a selection. And then me, I've been getting people to name some of the old shows as new shows, and then I, I go out if I like them, I get them. That's nice, yeah. Yeah, I like it because you know the setup's nice. I like the setup. Yeah, and then you got to think about this. I mean, TV shows is good too. But I got a lot of old movies as well too. A lot of the oldie but goodies uh, TV shows too. And some I mean, of the movies, older movies, movies. Some of the older new movies be having problems at times. And I think too that some of the older people, you know, they still like that Roku. It's just easy to use, you know. So being able to have Plex on that, you can share your library with them. You know that that's that's going to be a good little setup for them. Yeah. Mm. What's up with the Plex on uh the Playstations? I heard a lot of people getting mad about it. You Hello? hear about that? Oh, yeah. uh, I haven't heard, I heard it. about it. Like it was like uh, a week I don't want to get upset about it, but I haven't really heard heard about it. Yeah, they was getting upset about the Plex on the uh Playstations. What is they? Are they they're not working, or what is they not able I to get, the get, play? I get the whole story, but there was real uh. They was real mad about it. It was something that's that that wasn't working right. Right. Most people gotta make sure when they're using that server, they gotta make sure the server is good for whoever they're sharing it with. Oh, the sure case that oh. PS4 stops supporting Plex. Uh I don't know why they did that though. Yeah, that don't make no sense. That's gonna mm -hmm. hurt them. I guess that's why Xbox is better. <laughs> mm -hmm. How do you do it from your phone to computer or to Plex? The game. What's the question? It says Bo. How do you do it from your phone to computer or to Plex? That that's how I do it. I do it from my phone. I do it from my phone to my computer, and then I, I ship it over to my my to my Plex. Actually, they stopped supporting them completely. Urban Kings. I'm gonna check that out. What Urban say? Let me take a screenshot of that. I gotta remember to check that out and the notification thing. What's that? Um, Plex. What, what do you What do you say? PS4 stop stopped supporting. Oh, they stopped supporting Plex. It's completely. Wow. It's weird. Yeah, that is. Ah, uh, he said it was damaging. Probably. I'm gonna expand the Fire Stick. Somebody told me that they did expanded the 4K one, but I never personally tried. Because I, I tried on the older ones and I tried on the boxes, it's not possible. Mm -hmm. Oh, but see, y'all don't y'all don't get movies and like that. I was gonna say, do y'all y'all get any movies off of the off of your ABKs? Because I know Steven, I know you got um Real Bread. So do you do you use like some of your movies to get your movies and TV shows to get um to get use them your um using your phone? Well, I me, mean, I use my phone for basically ninety percent of everything, but I use um, my ADM. You familiar with ADM, right? Steve. So ADM is gonna be a advanced uh advanced download manager. I use ADM. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So I use ADM to get I, I use BTV, I use cinema, I use Cyberflix, any of those, I use those to get my movies from those using my real debris. Yeah, that's what mainly that's what real debris was really made for. Mm-hmm. And I use it, I use it that way to get it, and then I like I said, I get it and I have it go to my phone. Once I go to my, go to my phone, then I have it switch over. What's up, Eddie? That's one way. Well, that's one way. And then the other way was the way I'm going to show you what real had me do. And that way is like a whole lot faster because I, I don't do any work on that one. I you just pick what I want. Start buying movies from the store. You said who buy movies? It's just because people stop buying. Oh. You're oh. saying it was cutting into uh, 
PlayStation's profits because nobody was buying it out. Because it wasn't no good deal. Because what's going to happen is they just going to switch systems. Right. Come on over to Xbox, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I haven't turned on my Xbox in a while. I was uh I was testing some live TV on there. It was something I seen probably two years ago. And it was uh I bought this little cheap thirty dollar uh box that would connect to the second HDMI on the Xbox One. And then my antenna connected to that. And so I was able to voice uh change channels. Uh, on the Xbox, like I could literally say, Xbox, turn to Fox, Xbox, page up, Xbox, page down. So I was doing that for a while. I, I should probably make a video of that. That would be a good video, right there, Steve. Using your voice to uh, to change the channels and stuff. Like you can come home and be like, Xbox on, Xbox, ESPN. Right. Yeah, so it, it was a good uh, – and you can use anything, really, any, any box that, you know, can uh, – uh, you know, share your, uh, you know, your channels like that. Because pretty much the Xbox, it, it creates its own live TV guy too for free. Well, it ain't for free. You're paying for your Xbox live membership. But yeah, the TV guide in there is nice, man. On the, uh, even if you don't use your voice, like the TV guide for your antenna channels, really, really nice on the Xbox. I haven't really seen much people doing those yet lately. You might be able to use your uh your that what is it the hostage, the hall pitch, yeah. You might be able to. Uh, matter of fact, I think you can. Yeah, you can. Yeah, yeah. plug that into the. You got an Xbox, don't you? Mm-hmm. Yeah, you might want to try that. Xbox, uh, it worked for Xbox, Windows. You can do it on Shield too, though. You can control your channels. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. With your voice, yeah, voice. Yeah. Is it but better than know. PlayStation View? No, this is just for your local stuff, Wilbur. They say, what's the name now? A lot of people, they say uh, YouTube TV, it kind of went ahead of PlayStation View. Yeah, they're, they're doing real good. <laughs> they're doing real good. Mm -hmm. I kind of figured that would, that would happen, though. Because I remember PlayStation View was my favorite. I was, it was between PlayStation View and Sling, but Sling had lost a lot of channels. So then I was, uh, I was like, yeah, PlayStation View got it. Then YouTube TV came out, and I was like, in a few years, YouTube TV is going to be the best. <laughs> How many devices do they get? It, it, the PlayStation, you can share those, can't you? Like, you can share with a friend or whatever. I don't, <laughs> I think it's a number of like two or three or something like that. I'm not sure. It's not many. One them, yeah, one of them has like five. I don't know which one it is. Somebody was saying one of them has five. I was like, five? They, they, they clap down on that stuff. Yeah. Even Netflix was talking about that because, you know, you, you used to get a Netflix account and be able to share with everybody. Yeah. Somebody, a family had Netflix. You all had Netflix. Not no more. <laughs> yeah, they scraped that up. Steven, do you see Mark Soloff question? What did he say? I don't know. I'm looking. I'm seeing his bottom scrap. He said something about the fire. Something about the fire stick. You see anything from him? I think I answered that. He just said hello. Do you see my questions? Right. That's all. Right. Memory <laughs> fire stick. We answered that, Mark. We answered that. Why well, I answered it? I said I haven't been able to expand it. Because they don't have adaptive storage. What's that? One the, person who said they did it with the Fire Stick 4K, but I never tried no Fire Stick 4K because well, I'll, beyond the Fire Stick 4K, you know Dale get the the dongle. You know Dale get the dongle, and him using the dongle. Well, he used the dongle to use it for the wireless mouses. No, I'm talking about. He talking about expanding oh, he storage, right? I think he, he, might, be, storage. he might be able to put USB. He might be able to um, what is a USB um. Well, in that dungle, there's a hub in there too for you to stick a USB in. I, I can ask, actually ask Dale if he can add storage too, but I don't think it's. I don't think it's. it's I don't know. It, 
for me to, to add scores to the, to the sticks is not, I don't, know, I don't think it's good. Um, because if you notice, if you notice, Stephen, I don't know if you remember, but remember the boxes, the TV boxes? Yeah. You only can put certain amount of storage over over to the um to the uh extra storage. Yeah, it's only a certain because it's not yeah. really adopt it's not real adopted storage. Right. That's what I was saying. So I don't think you really I don't think you really should even want to do it do that anyway for the um for the fire sticks or the um 4K. Yeah, UTA Prime has a real good video on on doing that with the uh with the fire stick. It's just he's got a little simple setup where it's you know, um, it's got. A, I think it's got like three USB ports. And yeah, but he, but it won't do it for. I seen who you talk about. It's a, it's a setup. Right. It won't go. It's adaptive storage. Yeah, no, not adaptive. That's, that's the thing I'm saying. Most people want it. It'll be on there, but it's not for the like. Like Stephen said, it's not for the adaptive storage. It's only going to take five percent or ten percent of that app to put on the waste. On to, yeah, and it's and the rest <laughs> probably gonna go into the stick, which is gonna take away from the stick. Unless you really just want to use it as external storage, I can right. see that. Like if you want a game or something, have it pulling some games from external storage. But if you look into really use as external storage, it's just it's a waste. You might as well just got a different device, basically. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't know why you want to go through all that. It's not. Just, it's, it's good. Why go through all that headache? Secondary device, or like if you want to just do some regular stuff, if you just want to stream. It's like by the time you buy all the extra stuff, you, I mean, you're getting close to a, a high quality box by then. Yeah. <laughs> Why not use the thumb drive? Because it's not going to, you can use it just for external device. You can't adapt to storage, Mark. <clears throat> Unless they unless they switched it with the 4K, I'm gonna test that. Well, I don't, know, I don't got my adapter no more. I can't test it for you because I don't got my adapter. But I tried all of them besides the 4K, and they didn't have it. Oh damn! It's like 11:30. Oh yeah, I got the roll. <laughs> Up in Ohio. <laughs> I'm gonna get ready to go too. Probably like eight minutes. Yeah, let's call guys. Ten thirty. Well, yeah, I appreciate you having me on, man. I appreciate you having me on, oh, Steve. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Shout out, to, shout out to all you guys for joining the show. Make sure you guys uh subscribe to his YouTube channel as well, Aldrin Mayfield. Okay, Aldrin, that's what's up. We're looking out, and also um to Steve. I appreciate you for having me on. Yep, you going too. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm gonna stay to y'all eight minutes till you leave. I'm, I'm oh, gonna yeah. stay and appreciate you. I'll drink away eight minutes. Oh, you want me to wait? I'll wait eight minutes. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah. I can wait eight minutes. Okay, <laughs> do it. <laughs> Watching YouTube on protect projector is pretty cool. Yeah, I like those projectors too. You can't store APKs on a thumb drive. Yeah, you can store the file. Yeah, you can store files. And stuff like that on a thumb drive. It's, it's external storage. <clears throat> but that data, for you to store actually installed app data on a, on, a, on any external drive, it has to be adapted to internal storage. Mark. YouTube TV is not worth the money, they said. <laughs> What is that? Somebody said YouTube TV is not worth the money. Hey, I don't know. I mean, it depends, guys. I mean, it's not bad. It's What's better that? than cable. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't knock legitimate streaming uh, uh, services. I, I just knock cable. Mm -hmm. You know, because I, I don't knock Netflix and stuff like that. I ain't knocking it. Because the realistic thing is, everything can't be free, guys. Mm hmm You guys got what Steve, we got to go with music, majority of it say. Go with personal preference. You got to find out what works for you. Yeah. And Test them all. I mean, as love. long as you ain't signing a contract, you know, if you ain't signing a contract, try, try them all. Mm hmm Yeah, you can get a trial for them. IPTV over YouTube. TV any day. Yeah. 
Well, I mean, YouTube TV is IPTV. <laughs> legitimate one. Yeah. <laughs> Same thing with Sling and the rest of them. Yeah, and those yeah, those yeah. are streaming services. Mm -hmm. And I can't yeah. knock them because those cord cutting services too. When you talk about cord cutting services, you're just not talking about uh, Cody or streaming APKs, guys. You talk of you when you actually talking cord cutting services, you talk about all these services other than cable. Yeah, I don't like the L word. <laughs> uh, X X C Tex. Yeah, that, that's a slippery slope. I mean, there's a gray area. You see his comment. Yeah, there's there's a gray area. I mean, it is what it is. Yeah. I'm not gonna tell y'all what to do. I'm just gonna <laughs> show y'all some stuff. But I'm not gonna tell y'all what to do. Well, I know one thing. If everything is was it if something wasn't paid for, nothing would exist. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So some stuff got to be paid for. I'm just going to, we going to leave it at that. Yeah. <laughs> Steven, what's your, um, what's your uh, favorite um, remote? remote? Dan, Dan said, what's the remote that you, the remote that you like the most? You had it, uh, you told him about it a while back? It's a big ass keyboard. Controller? Uh, keyboard. I use a keyboard. It says, what's up, Steve? Hey, what was that remote you liked the most? You told me a while back. Uh, I used the keyboard. I used, used the uh, Logitech K400 Plus. And they still sell that too, don't they? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep, I still had this thing for years. Uh... Let me see. I was just looking. He like, how much I got? Description. Oh, descriptive stream. How uh, do we get it today, guys? <laughs> they actually about the giveaway. Oh. Uh, we only got 214. Oh, wait a minute. So there's a remote. From the same company that made the Minix Remote A3. Yeah. Yeah, they got. Oh, no, I didn't see the new remote. I seen the Minix remotes. I guess there's a, a new remote that is from the same company. The same company that made Minix Remote A3. I, I don't know. I haven't seen that one yet. Me either. XC Text, where you, where you, where did you find it at? Oh, it's called the, the ARQ100. It said best to leave a VPN on while using a fire stick. I mean, a VPN depends on what you're doing. I mean, it depends on your location and depends on what you're doing. So I don't know. I need more information on that. Yeah, are you downloading? <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, there you it go. depends on what country. Because every you know, different countries have streaming laws too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. What is it? Uh, they are. Let me see if I can find it. It's a super Dale guy. I'm going to get ready to get out of here, guys. I want to thank my guests. Thank Bo Knows. Uh, and Al make sure you guys subscribe to their YouTube channels as well. Um, shout out to all my mods. The real. Uh, who else I saying? Zombie. Um, I think it's just seen the real and zombie. Mm -hmm. I haven't really seen Trooper today. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm my bad. Hey, hey, wait a minute. You still got one minute. You can't leave. So, and, uh, shout out to all my sponsors on the channel. I'm gonna fix the sponsor thing. I'm, I gotta read it first because I want I want to make sure before they yeah. get me the sign and stuff. Make sure you fix I it. I really agree to it. Fix it. Uh, that remote twenty nine thirty dollars for that remote. It looked good though. I ain't paid $30 for the remote. <laughs> I'm like, man. 
I ain't $30 for no more. You might as well get a what's name then. You might as well get the uh, Logitech. What's a $25? Logitech is going to last you some years. This shit got a fingerprint sensor on it or something. Woo. <laughs> It's an air mouse keyboard remote for Buzz TV, Obby TV, Android. Um, Florida. I mean, it depends. It's in Florida, Mark, I mean, if you're just streaming, if it's just regular sources and not turret based, um, don't have to have a VPN on all the time. Yeah, don't use torrents, don't download, and you're going to be safe. There you go. I'm going to do a what's the name VPN video. Uh, up. Next week. Hey, did you ever do that review for that box? Huh? Did you ever do that review for the box? Yeah, I tried to. I tried to. Uh, it didn't work. It didn't work what I was trying to do, so I'm going to have to do the video over. And it was so late. You know, I did the video. Then when it didn't work, I was like 15 minutes into the video. I'm like, I'm not about to do this over with. <laughs> I knew I did wrong. Yeah. <laughs> so I was the like, T90, I'll do another day. The T95? Yeah, I mean, yeah, it worked. But what I was trying to do, a file, I downloaded a, a wrong file. Oh, oh what? Beat him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm looking like, what the? My bad, Steve. My bad. <laughs> you good. You good. Well, thank you all for coming. See you on the next one. Like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit Shout the thumbs up. Guys and the sponsors, guys. Thanks for joining us. Um, you always cut me off. Why? <laughs> I thought you was done. Go ahead. No, right. I'm not right. done. Forget it. Go ahead. I ain't going to say nothing. Finish. I like to finish. <laughs> <laughs> you want to end the show? Go, go. We're going to end the show. Peace, my peoples. Have a good one. <laughs> See y'all. Peace. Hey. Hey.